everybody. Welcome to a quickie with Miss B. Today is your Tuesday. <laughs> All this week we're talking about those funny words and the weird definitions that go along with them. So if you missed the previous episode, please go back and check that out. And as always, thanks so much for joining us. And uh, don't do it alone. Bring lots of friends. Yes. <laughs> That way you have something to stare at when they're saying, here, here, here's the <laughs> definitions of these words. <laughs> okay, here's some really weird ones, and I don't know time frame-wise where these ones came from, what era, but the, <laughs> the first one <laughs> is squirrel. Squirrel? Squirrel. Squirrel or squirrel? Squirrel. S-K-I-R-L. Squirrel. Squirrel. Yeah. Well, that's somebody from down south who couldn't say squirrel. <laughs> you see that? Y'all see that, y'all see that squirrel y'all over there? He's squirrel? just futzing around. <laughs> yeah. He's futzing. He's futzing in that tree. He's futzing in that tree. Squirreling all around there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm put him in a. I'm going to put him in a pot pretty soon and have him with my hoe cakes. <laughs> The definition of this word is a loud wailing sound that bagpipes make. Oh, wow. <laughs> Who knew? <laughs> Maybe if you're a piper, you would know that, but other than Girl. that, I don't think anybody would. Yeah. yeah he's, boy, sometimes they <laughs> wailing. Today he's skirling. Yeah. <laughs> skirl it, man. Skirl it, man. Skirl it. <laughs> I wonder if they have metal bagpipes. And they can all just sit there and headbang to the squirrel. (laughs) I don't know. Here's the next one. (laughs) This one's called Wittershins. (laughs) Wittershins. Yep. So there are kids going, Mommy, what? Wittershins? (laughs) Well, shins, shins are right down here. They're below your knee and above your ankle. That's where her shins are. <laughs> this is a funny word that means something that is moving in the wrong direction or counterclockwise. <laughs> so don't say backwards, just say Witter shins. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine that plane trains plane trains and automobiles instead of you're going the wrong way, they go, What are shins? What are shins? <laughs> Hello, what are shins? I like the I like the you're going the wrong way better. <laughs> you're going the wrong way. <laughs> I don't think anybody would ever use that word no. winter shins. <laughs> it just sounds stupid. <laughs> oh, here's another one for you. Way sucks. Way sucks. Mm-hmm. Way sucks. Well, since I tried logic to figure out these words, and we know that doesn't work. Because, I mean, it, it sounds to me uh-huh. like, you know, I don't, I, don't, I don't like doing that. Well, how would you rate it on a scale of 1 to 10? It way sucks. <laughs> oh, okay. So that's like a 1. Yes, 1 way sucks. So if, if 1 is way sucks and 10 yes. is doesn't suck, which, you know, way sucks. <laughs> the definition of this is saying, um, what the heck? <laughs> I can't even recover from that one. All right, moving on. Wait a minute. Wait, no, 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 no. What is it? I want to hear it. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. What's the definition? <laughs> Instead of saying alas, you can say this goofy word. So a girl? <laughs> it means a girl? Stupid. Instead of saying alas, oh, oh. you can say this goofy word. Way sucks. Okay. Yeah. So instead of, <laughs> I wanted to be there, but alas, I couldn't. <laughs> So instead of alas, it'd be like, I wanted to be there. Way sucks. No, not for me. (laughs) Wow, that's hard to use. Way sucks. I I just want to know if anybody's ever used any of these words for reals. Well, I just did. (laughs) So the answer to that question is yes. Is there another another word for yes? I don't don't know. (laughs) The answer to that is positively. Here's another one for you. 
Smays. Uh oh, Smays. <laughs> now, that sounds like someone's uh, slang, a little slang for get some corn, you know? <laughs> I need some more. I need some more Smays. I need some Smays. That, that, that's some more maize. Smays. <laughs> Making tortillas over here. Need smash. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. That... The, <laughs> the definition of this smaze is what you get when you combine um, smoke and haze. Ta-da, smaze. Smoke, smoke and haze, what? Yeah. Oh, so if it's got a fire going and it's hazy outside, you have smaze. Oh, it's, wow. you got smaze. Oh, wow. <laughs> Idiots, unite. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I need to take a break. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. You're listening to a quickie with Miss B. And if or, you miss the first, or schmaze, as we like to forget. <laughs> you missed the first half of the episode. Please go back and check that out. <laughs> you would have to do the witter shins. Witter shins. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Go backwards. Yeah, <laughs> Mommy, witter shins. Bam! As I smack you into last week, you'll understand. <clears throat> okay, let's see what the next one on the list is. Finny fungal. <laughs> Finny fungal. <laughs> It's like a guy named Finney who's got a oh. whole lot of confusion. <laughs> oh, happening. I'm sorry. Finney Fugal. Not fungal. Fugal. Finney well, Fugal. Well, heck, that made everything different, sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I said it wrong. Hold on. Yeah, that makes it better. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> Finney F- Fugal instead of fungal. <laughs> Finney Fugal. Finney Fugal. <laughs> Not to be confused with that nasty Italian swear world. That's Finny, pretty close Finny, to that one. Finny Fugle. Yeah. Finny Fugle. <laughs> this is what you call someone who is afraid of finishing anything. <laughs> so they replaced loser with Finny Fugle. <laughs> Why can you get nothing done? You're such a stinking loser. You're such a finny fugal. I mean, you're just, you know, there's a lot of words for people like you, but finny fugal comes to mind. Oh, my word. Yes. Let the, let, let the stupid abound. <laughs> She's such a finny fugal. <laughs> One minute she's here, the next minute. Now, we used to call it flighty. Yeah. All, all sorts of things, you know. Mm-hmm. She, can't, she, she can't buckle down and do anything, you know. No, nope, no. Nope. Finny yeah. fugal. Mm-hmm. I, 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 I wish someone would go on an interview on TV and only, <laughs> and only use all these phrases. Can you imagine trying to use all these words? Yeah. I think that'd be hilarious. Can you? Here's next. Can you scooch over there? Oh, you want me to white, 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 white shins? Yeah. Okay. Right here. What? What? <laughs> what? Well, I gotta hurry up and get completed. Why? Because Finny Fugle, you know. <laughs> don't need, I don't want to be don't, labeled as a Finny yeah, Fugle. <laughs> don't want that. Don't want that label thrown on me. You know. It is ABC, so you know. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the next one. Octothorpe. Oh wow. Well. I'm going to go with Octothorpe would mean whatever thorping is, it's done eight times. <laughs> you know, I probably pres- pronounce this. You proper prosonym. Pr- 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 what? <laughs> Yvonne Bebe. <laughs> Ooh la la. <laughs> <laughs> what? I, I probably am mispronouncing this. <clears throat> is it octo or octa? Octo. O C T O. Octo. T H O R. Thor. P E. Octothorpe. Okay. Octothorpe, yeah. 
Uh, this is why people may call the symbol a hashtag. That's what the real name is, is an octo. Oh, I like that, though. Sign me. Octothorpe. So you can't say hashtag. Octothorpe. <laughs> Best mommy ever. <laughs> oh. Octothorpe. Me. Just me. I like it. Octotharp Fridays. <laughs> yeah. Gotta got start a whole new thing, man. Octotharp Smeeze. <laughs> Octotharp Best Me Ever. <laughs> it's official. It's kind of problems. funny because you only have to say one word versus two, you know. Yeah. Octotharp was much shorter than saying hashtag. Okay. I got my I'm hashtag. <laughs> <laughs> Not Octothor- that can be. <laughs> Octothorp. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the next one. Noob. 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 N-O-O-B. See, Noob. now, noob has always been a, a newbie. Someone who's relatively uh, unexper- mm-hmm. unexperienced at a task is what I've heard it to be. So what what, what does that say? To yeah. It? This word is, is used when somebody's inexperienced with something, usually referring them to the use of the internet or a video game. Okay. Noob. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. I knew that one. <laughs> How about foppish? Foppish? <laughs> foppish? Foppish. <laughs> your, mo- your mom's coming over tomorrow, so be- remember one thing. Don't be so foppish, okay? <laughs> That's kind of funny. Mean? It's um, If someone is always super concerned with how their outfit looks, you can refer to them as foppish. <laughs> Is that like fabulous, but messed up? <laughs> Stop being so foppish. It'll give you the collie wobbles. <laughs> Where's Shin? Where's Shin? And on that note, we got to go find Wershins. <laughs>